Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Taurus January 30, 2022. Today is one of those days in which you might be kicking yourself for not telling the truth in the past. The words which seemed so harmless and you spoke them may now be coming back to haunt you. Today is a very action-oriented day, and there may be some conflict when something you thought was true turns out to not be so. Are you feeling like you are in a one-way street relationship in your romantic connection? As accustomed as you are to giving, 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 it may be time for you to be on the receiving end of some kindnesses. It takes a big person to tell their partner that they have needs for nurturing too. This is not a sign of weakness, rather, it is a reflection of your humanness. Unexpected developments in the life of a friend, or within a group you are affiliated with could have you reeling from the shock. You might feel the need to do whatever you can to put things back to normal, and thus you may expend a tremendous amount of effort towards this end. This is fine, as long as you don't overwork and get too stressed out. Everything should straighten out within the next day or so. You might find that you are getting swamped at by a million different pieces of information coming your way. The good news is that your brain is quick and nimble, and that you should be able to navigate through the pile of jobs that have accumulated on top of you. Dismiss the notion that there is no more room left to store anything. It will be hard interacting with people today. You overreact to the smallest things and feel completely misunderstood. It would do you good to take a step back, clear your thoughts and start tackling the arguments in a calmer way. You need to do something serious about your latest big plan even if it seems to be puttering along right on time. You can tell that those little improvements will go a long way toward getting you someplace good. If the response you get from prospective dates is not always positive, consider how your approach might be improved. You may want to ask what you could change about yourself. Becoming more self-aware can help you understand what to change or at least help you appreciate another's point of view or not. New friends are very much in the picture today. It may be that someone you met at a party stops by for drinks. Make sure your house is in tip-top shape for the occasion. As you are tidying up, you may become aware of some home improvements that really shouldn't be put off much longer. A new coat of paint is in order, at the least, as well as a slew of minor household repairs. At this point, any changes you make would be for the better. Is it time you made some changes to your lifestyle? If so, this day, can give you the stamina and drive to get things rolling. While your time as a six may often be spent caring for everyone else, there comes a time when you have to make the effort to improve your situation. If you continue to put things off, you can bet that nothing will happen as you hope it will. Use this day's essence to assist you in being proactive in your life. Congratulations! You are now entering a much lighter and more peaceful period than the one which just ended. Lately, you have been challenged and forced to assert yourself in many ways. But beginning today, personal growth will involve communication, togetherness, and cooperation. Enjoy it, but be careful not to lose the assertiveness skills you learned last month. While Mercury will remain in retrograde motion in Capricorn for another six days, having just returned three days ago his focus will be more on tying up loose ends. It is Venus' direct turn here today that brings you to a major turning point and nine days after your birthday month ended, this is the point when you are finally ready to embrace the future. For days after Mars' return the moon comes full circle from a new moon in Capricorn at the start of the year, with an opportunity for a do-over and to draw a new line in the sand. What began with Uranus' direct turn in your romantic sector 10 days ago completes as Venus, the planet of love turns direct in Capricorn today. While Mercury will remain in retrograde motion in Capricorn for another six days, 
all the planets that are focused on romance are now looking to the future and at a time when there is an awful lot to look forward to. The Sagittarius moon forms a harsh aspect to hazy Neptune, so early risers could find that their morning is a bit overwhelming or disconnected. For those who are still sleeping, some scattered and nonsensical dreams may find you, but try not to read too much into them. Luckily, the momentum won't suffer for long, because Lady Luna forms a supportive aspect to action planet Mars just as the day begins to take off. Love is in the air this afternoon when the moon forms a helpful connection to sweet Venus. People could be in a generous mood, making it the perfect time to spoil that special someone. If you're single, use this time as an excellent excuse to treat yourself. Financial opportunities could manifest under this cosmic climate as well, so keep your eyes open for new ways to pad your wallet. Later, we feel a shift when the moon changes signs into Sirius Capricorn, bringing us all back down to Earth after the high vibes that occurred earlier. Venus moves into Virgo this evening, elevating our expectations around love in the coming weeks. Just try not to be overly critical of your partner during this time. As the evening comes to a close, check in with your body to see if there's any tension that needs to be released by stretching or enjoying a hot bath. In the morning, the Sagittarius moon forms a square to Neptune in Pisces, creating difficulties in achieving clarity. We are in an optimistic mood, eager for adventure, and subsequently, avoiding our daily obligations and tasks under the guise of self-improvement. Unfortunately, Neptune exacerbates this issue, not by forcing us to confront the mundane, but by causing us to forget about it altogether. The universe could be giving us directives to slow down or pay attention, yet we are ignoring the warning signs and red flags. The irony here is that we might be undertaking a healing journey, and if we sat still for a minute, we would see that the answers we're seeking are closer than we believe. After sunup the moon forms a trine to Mars, helping us to use our willpower appropriately. This is a great influence for overcoming personal challenges and circumstantial hiccups.